Hey guys, this is Undercover Dudes all the way from down and, and today I have some leaked gameplay from Combat Arms Korea and a massive thank you to my little phony 68 who went and put this footage on his YouTube channel because he goes and plays Combat Arms Korea. So the first thing you're seeing right now is the M16A4, a new GP assault rifle, GP rare assault rifle and the sound is absolutely amazing, I'll let you guys hear it. Now, next part of this gameplay is about the new map and the new mode. Now, the new mode is VIP, and the uploader said that one team has to go and escort a VIP to the LZ, and one team has to go and kill the VIP. Now, when I first thought of this, I thought it was just going to be an ongoing game. You keep respawning and all that, but it's actually round-based, and you'll see it later on. Once you die, you can't respawn. But saying that, the map is the bay, it's based, loosely based, off the favelas in Brazil, which is kind of like these run-down houses made with sheet metal and all that. So the player's gone and died right now, my little phony, and as you can see, he's gone and spectating his other, his teammates, of which they're going to go and try to go and finish out the objective. So this is pretty cool in my opinion. I'm definitely looking forward to a new mode. I always, always like some new stuff in Combat Arms and this is definitely, you know, what I'm looking for. Something a bit different from Nexon. Because all they've been doing this last time is just going to rehashing modes. But gun game, arms race, whatever you, whatever you want to call it. And they've really gone and done some good stuff. Now, as you can just see before, a nice little helicopter symbol flashed up. And I assume that's when you can actually go and finish off the objective, when you can actually go and secure the hostage, the VIP. And what would that happen? It was like the one minute countdown. As you can see, top right hand corner right now is 57, 56. It's counting down. And when that gets to zero, that's when you'll be actu actually be able to finish the objective per se. Now, obviously, if you kill the whole other team, it's going to be like search and destroy. It's going to count as a victory as well. But that's pretty cool how you can't just go and rush the objective and just rush it back to your base. You actually got to play a bit tactically and wait around. In fact, these actual capture sites are in very, very, very open areas. So a lot of teamwork in this mode. Definitely going to be enjoying it. So hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure to go and drop it a like rating. And check out my little phony 68. I'm sure he'll be uploading some more Combat Arms Korea gameplay of all these new leaked modes and maps and stuff like that. Because Korea always gets everything before NA and EU and that. So definitely, definitely looking out for that type of stuff. Bye for now. It's Undercover Dudes, all the way from Danada. Out.